Joining me today is Guillaume Brahimi. He is a fabulous chef. He has one of my favourite fine dining restaurants in Sydney called Guillaume in Paddington is to die for. Everyone has to go there. And that is quite fine dining. But today you're going to show me a recipe that's true to your heart, moule marinière. That's great, Justine. Thanks for having me. Oh, I love um, when you come on the show. This is, <laughs> this is my favourite Saturday Sunday lunch. Mm. You go to the market, buy the mussel, have friends over, eat, take five minutes and you're going to have some very happy people around. Five minutes, that's incredible. So, talk to me first about mussels. What are we looking for? Okay, firstly, mm -hmm. very simple, smell beautiful, mm. it's fresh, okay? Smells like Seafood the ocean. Seafood smell like the ocean. Mm. If it doesn't, there's a big problem, don't use it. Absolutely. Okay? And after that, you see, are they fresh, are they close? Mm. It, you know, you can tell how fresh they are. Very important, you take the beer off because you don't want that. Just nicely, they come. All right, let's get started. Today, okay. What's going into So very simple. Like I said, five minutes. It takes a little bit longer when I talk. <laughs> but here we go. Some shallots. That's my favourite type of cooking, though. In the kitchen with a glass of wine, yeah. cooking around um, the stovetop. <laughs> and, and everybody's around, you know. Like my parents, I remember my grandmother saying, I bought some mussel. Everybody's there. It's one o'clock in the afternoon and she's cooking the mussel. And you see everybody's face waiting for it. Amazing. OK, that's enough. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to put my butter. Mm -hmm some heat in it. Mm -hmm. Be careful, you don't want to burn the butter, mm -hmm. okay, so it's nice. Yep. And you don't want to burn the shallots. Huh? No. And one thing is so important, if you burn something, doesn't matter if it takes 10 hours to cook, you will still have the burnt flavour. So start again, don't try to hide it. We're going to leave them for a couple minutes like that. Mm -hmm. In the meantime, because there is not such a thing as French food without la baguette. Can't and we've got some it. beautiful baguette and do you need the bread with that dish? Not really, but I love it, so I'm going to put some in. OK, let's keep focusing. Yes. My shallots are beautiful, and here we go. So when we've put the mussels in, they don't take long to cook, but how do we know they're cooked? Very simple, they're open. If they're not open, they're not cooked. <laughs> so here we go. I've got my mussel. Mm -hmm. I put my white wine. OK. Just a touch of salt, not too much. Remember, the mussel come from the sea. There's plenty of salt in yeah. the sea, but I just want to put a touch. What, what are these mussels called? What's, what's this variety? Bouchon. 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 Yep. Yeah. Yep. And Austria is getting very, very, very good with mussel. We are very privileged. We are indeed. OK, done. Yep. I put my lid. Yep. Few minutes like that. In the meantime, mm -hmm. I'm going to finish my crouton. OK, a so, so, little bit of olive oil? Yeah, just, you know, why not? Why not? We've put you some know, butter on? No, do you know why? People keep saying to me, I only use butter and cream. I said, no, look, I'm putting, <laughs> some, I'm putting a little bit of olive oil. <laughs> here we go. And I've got my grill here. Just, and when you char grill the bread, we're going to get that nice smokiness right, and the right. char. And, and, and everything good. works together, you know. Yep. So, Justin, when that's mm -hmm. cooking, I'm going to chop my parsley. Sure. So, roughly, this is... Home cooking, mm -hmm. this is all about fern. Absolutely. Should we check a mussel? Yes, please. Tell me about the pot you use when okay. you're cooking mussels at home. Okay. There is a great thing about cooking, and it's about common sense. You want as much flat as possible mm -hmm. to give the same amount of heat to your mussels. So Absolutely. they all cook at the same time. And look at that. Oh. Look at that. Yum. <laughs> Let's be careful with my baguette yes. because we don't want to burn them. And look at Ooh, that. Oh, looks good. Just nicely coloured. Ooh, yum, yum. yum. <laughs> And look at that, they're ready, but what we need to do, we need to be quick by putting a creme fraiche. Okay. This dish comes from Normandy, yes. and Normandy is a place of birth of creme fraiche. Mm -hmm. okay? And now we are so lucky in Australia, we are able to make great creme fraiche. Oh, okay? yes, absolutely. So what I'm going to do is, you know what? <gasps> yes. Chef, that's a lot of cream. This is what it's all about, you're making moule marinière. Okay, <laughs> don't, don't try to say, worry about it tomorrow. Absolutely. You know, so I'm just going to leave it like that. I'm going to put the lid on. Beautiful. And I'm going to leave the creme fraiche to dissolve mm -hmm. for one minute. Great. OK, so all you're doing now, <laughs> best part of it, before eating them, it's pour this Oh, yes. That is just so beautiful. And I wish you could smell through the television because this is one of my favourite smells. Cream and white wine and eschalot together. And the mussels. 
And now, Justine, I'm going to show you how we eat mussel. I'm sure you know, but for all a friend, I just yep. want to... It's a very simple one. So the first thing is you need to get one. Mm -hmm. And you eat it. Oh, how lucky! Two. I've got two! Well, somebody's going to miss out. Mm. And I pick a small one. The reason for it, very simple. Mm -hmm. I'm using that. Mm, as a little pick. Mm -hmm. That's the way to do it. Leave this one and... Mm -hmm. Crunchy bread. I'm in heaven right now. Mussels, Guillaume cooking for me. It doesn't get much better than this. Let's share. Let's share this. Absolutely. Usually I don't like sharing. Justin, it's all about the produce. <laughs> great muscle, great cream, good baguette, happy days. It's all you need. Guillaume said it. <laughs>